Hey everyone, today's video is a shop with me at Dollar Tree, but makeup edition, because I've found some popular drugstore brands like Maybelline and Wet n Wild, just to name a few. I have been very hesitant on doing Dollar Tree videos because I have a very close friend who does do these types of videos, and I don't want to step on her toes, you know? But first, before I get started, so I would like to shout her out. Her name is Bargain Beauty. I'm sure you've heard of her before, but if you haven't, she does a whole bunch of Shop With Me videos at various stores. I'll leave her channel link in the description. I'm about to get to the video, but I just wanted to say that I do have swatches of everything that I bought, so stay tuned till the end. Alright, now let's get into the Shop With Me video. So I want to go ahead and add this, even though I know it's not new, but I wanted to let you know that these are really, really good. They're just like the original makeup eraser that cost $20. The only thing is it's half its size, which I like it better like that, but they do work very well and very comparable to the $20 one. Next up is an eyeshadow palette by Hard Candy called All That Rose Gold. It's normally like at Walmart for like $10, so this is a really good price. And it is very pretty and it's great for Valentine's Day. It's got your nice little pinks and reds in there. Then I had found some liquid lippies from Broadway, and they are matte. I didn't pick up any of these because they are matte, and I don't like matte liquid lippies. But they are pretty cool colors there. You got your neutrals, your pinks, purples, and your dark vampy colors. You know, a good variety. And I'm sorry I'm trying to pan up, but I'm only 4'9", so it's hard for me to get to the top shelf. Now the next item is a Wet n Wild Liquid Cat Suits. You might find more colors at your store, but mine only have three, and I do have a couple of these to swatch. Here's a Wet n Wild Cushion Color Corrector in green. It's usually used to, like, cancel out redness, and this goes for, like, 5 bucks at Walmart. Now both of these had different colors for each one of them and got the stick foundation and the liquid original foundation from Wet n Wild that go for normally like $5. I found another color corrector but this time in a peach color. I did pick this one up. I use this type of thing for brightening and I use it in the corner of my eyes. Now this Maybelline Falsies, they tricked me because I thought it was a black but it's actually a navy blue and then they have the Maybelline Snapscara in like blue, purple, and then uh, like a black cherry. I did pick all of these up because my daughter is into these type of things. I do have them swatched at the end. So if you want to see the actual color, be sure to check out the end because I do swatch them all. Now I thought these were pretty cool. They are the Sally Hansen's Insta Dry Nail Polishes. It seems like they collaborated with Crayola and Jelly Belly Jelly Beans. I was going to pick some up, but honestly, if I'm not actually getting my nails done, I paint my nails a neutral color, so it's kind of pointless. But yeah, I thought they were pretty cool, so I figured I'd go ahead and add them. So yeah, that's what I found at Dollar Tree. We're going to go ahead and get into all the stuff that I got and swatches. But I also want to point out that I apologize. Once I started editing this, I seen that I, the camera is a little, you know, jumpy and everything. I do apologize. I promise over time I will get better. All right, let's go ahead and get to the swatches. Alright, here's my haul. Like I said, I will swatch everything in a moment, but I got the eyeshadow palette, stick foundation, liquid foundation, peach color corrector, two lippies, and then these mascaras, which I will swatch those as well. And then not what's not makeup related that I picked up was this X-Acto knife with six blades. Then I got some stickers. If you don't know me, I love my dog Roscoe very much, so I figured I can figure out something to do with these, and they are the puffy stickers. So yeah, just stick around and I'll swatch these here now. Alright, here are the three mascaras. Very cute packaging. Right here we have Ultraviolet. Black Cherry, which I don't know if you can tell, but it's like a deep burgundy. And then we have Dear Blue. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch those. Oh, and... This one here, at first I thought this was the black one, but it's the navy blue. So I'll go ahead and swatch these four and let you see them. Alright, here are the swatches of the mascara. The one all the way to the right is the black cherry. It pretty much looks like a black. I very see very little hint of like a red. And then the bottom one is the falsies one, which is more like a navy blue. And then the... Snapscara one is actually like a cobalt blue. So there's those. And next I'll go ahead and swatch the eyeshadow palette. Alright, there is the palette swatched out. I mean, for a drugstore palette, it's good. I honestly don't buy drugstore palettes anymore because the pigment is not like exactly there like how I want to. But I do want to show you one thing. If you want to get this, I mean, it's only a dollar. It's great for a dollar. All right, moving on to let's swatch the lipsticks next. 
All right, I swatched them, but I thought this one was black and it really looks like black in person, but it's actually like a very, very deep plum. I got that for my daughter because I don't wear dark colors like that, but this, and it's called Late Night, so that's Late Night, and then this one here is Send Nudes, right here, Send Nudes. Heck of a name, but there's swatches. So yeah, that was my first shop with me at Dollar Tree with my little haul and swatches. Again, I do apologize for the quality. I promise it will get better if you stick around. And if you feel like sticking around, the subscribe button's down below along with the notification bell. And if you could do me a favor and hit the like button, I would greatly appreciate it. Also, check out Bargain Beauty. Her link will be in my description. She's an awesome, cool person, and I'm sure she'll like to have you. But anyways, until next time, I'll talk to you later. Bye.